There was a time, not so long ago, when mention of a meeting of the top two clubs in Scotland was shorthand for an old firm derby. In the continued absence of Rangers as credible contenders, the burden of mounting some form of challenge to Brendan Rodgers and co. has fallen upon Aberdeen, who responded last season by finishing as runners-up in all three domestic competitions. If that was a consistent response to the challenge, it also had the potential to be dispiriting for Derek McInnes and his squad, especially since Celtic won all six meetings of the pair and supplemented that record with a 3-0 victory at Pittadry in which they produced their single best display of football in 2017. Aberdeen subsequently lost to Rangers home and away but McInnes rebuffed the Ibrick Sports invitation to become their manager, as he had done with Sunderland's summer approach, prudently as events at the Stadium of Light were to demonstrate. In both instances McInnes declared that he had unfinished business at Pittadry which presumably included inflicting some sort of check on Celtic's imperious progress through the Scottish fixture calendar, a desire that can only have been sharpened by recent developments. Celtic finished the 2016-17 title campaign unbeaten and having shed only 8 points from 38 games.